Thomas up. <laughs> Thomas Frank who joins us now. Right. Thomas, good to see you. Look at how do you uh, take that result? Uh, given how hard you worked against <clears> Manchester United, you didn't get the result. How do you feel um, about this one? Every Premier League season is a tough season, and I've only been here three years. Okay, uh, this season seems to be a little bit tougher um, in many ways. And we have a lot of setbacks. So I see this as a, another good step going forward. Um, the boys worked unbelievable hard. Um, and if you can't win, classic one, don't lose. And on top of that, we've got a clean sheet. And we've been struggling, conceding some yeah. bad goals, you know, some bad defending, uh, and also some things maybe not going our way. Today, I think the boys did fantastic uh, in terms of defending. Uh, yes, they have 24 shots, but you know, or something like outside the box. Uh, they, for me, they had maybe it is a big is it a big chance. The one that Chris I can't remember who finished when Christopher Ayer blocks it. Is that a big chance? Yeah, it's a good chance. But when he blocks it, you know, it's not like a. Uh, of course, there's the header on the corner in the end. I think yeah, maybe, yeah. Well, and right. then uh, it looked very dangerous in the end. I didn't. I just turned away because of, <laughs> and then hoped. <laughs> uh, so I want to praise the boys for if yeah. you can't win, don't lose uh, against a good team. Um, they were good on the day. Uh, we gave very little away. Going forward, we lacked the final moment, I would say. Yeah. I mean, as you say, a very good defensive performance. Only your second clean sheet at home, which is a big bonus. And as you yeah. say, it's, it's improvement. Against a very good offensive team. Yeah, against a very good offensive team. And it's improvement game on game, isn't it? Because you are now winless in eight, but it's the performances that have... I know, not to Thank bring you. it home to you once again. <laughs> Sorry about that. Not to ruin your night completely. No. But it's the performances game on game that are improving, yeah. that do give yeah. you, you know, green sheets of hope, yeah. basically. You, you, you're, you're absolutely right. We have now... What is this? Five really good performances. Yeah. That is including the, the one at Burnley, where we are playing uh, 10 against 11 for 100 minutes. Uh, away to Arsenal, I think we are unlucky to lose. 2-2 two, two home, 1-1 uh, home, 0-0 nil, nil home against uh, where I think we are closer to win Chelsea and Man United. Both yeah. of them, I think we should have won. This one, I think we can't complain. A, a point is fine. When, when you look sort of at your performances and, and you are generally happy with those, when you look at your next fixtures, obviously a difficult one away at Aston Villa, but then you've got Sheffield United, Luton and Everton. Those are critical games, aren't they, Thomas? Uh, yes, definitely. Uh, but <laughs> I, I, I look first at the, at the Villa one, uh, <laughs> yes. of course. Uh, that, that's, uh, that's going to be very difficult, but we, we know when we are on it. We, uh, we, we can perform against any team, we can win against any team. So that's the first one. I'll do everything I can, try to win, and then I'll look into the next one after that. Like you say, perform performance is so hugely important for you, isn't it? Because I was here when you played against Manchester City, really good performance mm. in that game. Mm. The Liverpool first half, really good. Yep. Chelsea. So there's really encouraging signs. And is it important that we don't get carried away with the expectation that you've almost set yourself? Uh, yeah, but I, I think it's also, uh, how can you say, it's nice there's expectations because that means that we've done well. Um, and we have very big expectations to ourselves. I have big ex expectations to myself, to the team, to the club. Um, and we know there's something really good in this team. Uh, and when you're on that winless run, it the only thing is to stay calm, as calm as possible. I was going to say, how, how do you keep your demeanour? Because that, that is an art in itself, because yeah. obviously the players look to, towards you as, as their leader to, to remain calm. Mm. And, and I've, I've been in dressing rooms before mm. when I look towards my manager, and I, I think I can see him cracking and, mm. and it's making me nervous mm. as a player. Mm. So it's, it's mm. so important for you to, to, to give that calmness around mm. the place. Yeah, I, I, I try my best. Uh, I'm definitely not perfect. Uh, I try my best. I think... I would say it's more 8, 9 out of 10 and I'm very calm after a game. Uh, of course, you can always have the one where there's too much emotion so we feel too unfair treated for, for whatever reason. Uh, and then so the critical moment is just after the game and the day after, I think. Yeah. If you're very calm that after that, you, your emotions have let your body and yeah. you, you're a little <laughs> bit more fresh again and then you go again. And then I think, I think it's hugely important that you're positive and look at the... Of course, you need to adjust to things. If it's a, it's a bad mistake mm -hmm. and uh, we're not doing... Uh, defending well enough according to the principles, we need to adjust and say, hey, you need to be there and you need to run back and all that. But look at all the good stuff we're doing and keep, keep, keep uh, focusing on that.
Yeah, exactly. I mean, Ivan Tony. I know he's, he still hasn't gotten the score sheet in the last seven games. I know he's getting closer and closer. He is receiving treatment at the moment. Any update on that, Thomas? Uh, yeah, not, not, nothing big. Uh, I don't... You guys know there's a, <laughs> you don't play a game without a, there's a niggle somewhere uh, yeah. all over the body. Uh, so there's no games where you're 100%, so I would say there's nothing big. What's the key to getting him firing again, Thomas? Um, yeah, but again, you know, every every striker go through spells where they're not scoring um, enough, uh, you know, or on their chances. Uh, let, let, the most important thing is that he's on the end of them. Yeah. And against Man United, he was on the end of, of big chances and, and big moments. Goal as well, and, and today he? again. Uh, he would be irritated at himself because he actually had more time. The defender was yeah. so far yeah. away after he made the He's little the turn. Work, exactly. Just calm and then pass it in. Yeah. Okay, Thomas, easy thank to say you. When yeah. you are here. It is, it is, yes. <laughs> it is, oh, on this side of the line, so much yeah. easier. Yeah. We'll just keep saying it over yeah. here then, shall yeah. we? Thomas, thank you so no, much welcome. again. Well thank done. You thank, thank you so much. Thank you, guys.